So I am going to attempt to work on this tree that broke halfway up and is split all the way down the trunk. Uh, I'm gonna work on it. And the first thing I'm gonna do is get some of this top off. I'm gonna try to put a strap around it and see, hopefully, if I can get enough of a pull with my pickup to pull that top down so that it won't be so dangerous because I won't cut that trunk down. It'd be way too dangerous. No idea which way it's gonna fall or how it's gonna fall. Uh, it's really, really split the trunk. I'll take you over there real quick before I do any of this and let you see what that trunk looks like. And I know I've showed this tree on previous videos throughout the winter. This happened about halfway through winter. Well, you see that big crack in it? All the way down to the base. You can really see it a lot better from this side. So yeah, I do not want to be underneath here cutting on it without that other piece being gone, without the top being off and gone. And then I can kind of judge where this pieces of the trunk are gonna go as I'm cutting. And it'll be a lot safer. So I'm gonna get to it. Wish me luck. So like I said, my first plan or first order of business is to try to get rid of some of this top out of this tree.
So I still have two branches that are holding all of the weight. And if I cut them, that would be this branch and this branch. If I cut them, the, the tree's just going to fall back down deeper that way and I won't be able to get to it. And I won't have any way to undo the mess. But I am hoping I can get a strap on one of those branches, one of these two pieces and pull it and it will break it free from back up there. That is my hope, but I, I give it about a 25% chance of this actually working. I won't be holding my breath, I guarantee that. Okay, I am ready. I got the strap all hooked up and I am thinking and hoping that it doesn't happen this way, but one of these branches is probably gonna dig in and keep me from actually doing what I want to do. But I'm hoping that by grabbing the, the higher up one with the strap, I am hoping to uh, alleviate some of the some of the bind with that in the ground. So here we go. Well, that turned out way better than expected. I mean, instead of the tree snapping off uh, at the top where it bent over, it actually drug the whole tree down. Yep, worked out really well. I'm gonna go uh, look what the other side of this looks like, see what the trunk looks like. And I think we are out of the woods. Well, we live in the woods, but I do think that we have conquered this dilemma that the woods has thrown at us in true Alaska fashion, by hook or by crook. All right, let's see what, how it turned out. It looks a lot safer to me. In fact, I think all I have to do now is cut this off onto a stump and I might actually be able to pull it out so that I can cut it up into firewood. Just use that truck as a skitter. Yep, that worked out really well. I'm very happy with, with the success. Well, I call that a total success. <clears throat> I got the tree pulled out as far as I can right now, anyway. Got cut off on the base. Uh, I got it wrapped around the a Y here on that stump. So I'll end up just cutting it into blocks. And then <clears throat> once I get past that, I'll just cut it all up into blocks, grab on with my strap, pull it out the rest of the way and finish cutting it up. So that is a total win. So yeah, that, that went better than I expected. A lot better than I expected. I thought I was going to have to really fight for that 
to get that tree down and I was a little bit worried of how it would react. I I was hope, you know, my my best hope was that it would break up in the the tree would break where it bent over and then I could cut the rest of it down. But I actually drugged the whole thing over and that worked out even better, way safer. So I think God was watching out for me on that one for sure. <clears throat> but yep, it's not too bad. I made a mess of my mess, but I'll get that cleaned up probably tomorrow. I think I'm done for tonight. Uh, just take it easy. I don't want to do too much. <clears throat> uh, just want to take it easy and, and do things kind of slow right now anyway. And uh, yeah, I go from there. But yeah, I, that's a win. We're safe on the trail again. Well, I wasn't really too worried about it, but I knew as that tree aged, if, it, if I left it like it was, as it aged, it'd get more and more dangerous for us to be on that trail. So I wanted to get take get it taken care of while I could, and uh, I'm happy. But, so with that success, that's just going to about do it for me tonight. I want to thank you for watching this edition of Not So Remote Alaska. And until next time, may God bless and keep each and every one of you. And with that, I am out.